What's up, everybody? We're back. This is one of the games I've been wishing I had the cash to go ahead and pick up for a while. Let's go ahead and bring the sound down just a hair. There we go. All right. Uh, this is called Robo RoboQuest? Robot Quest? RoboQuest? Something like that? Uh, this is the demo. Uh, I think it's for, I think the full version is like $24.99 on, uh, on Steam. So I decided that, you know, if I'm going to go ahead and, uh, you know, do these kind of videos that are on demos, like with the Age of Hell demo, I totally suggest you go watch that. If you haven't seen it, it is pretty, it looks like it, it was super fun and, uh, the aesthetic is awesome. Uh, but this one is more like wave-based kind of thing going on. So we're going to go in here and check it out. I watched, uh, what's this face? I'm going to turn it down a little bit too much. We'll go ahead and turn it back up once we're in the game. If I can get to a setting screen. You, you must go to the city. Let's try to open that door. Give me a sec, okay. Hold on, let me see if I can turn this back up just a little bit. Go to like uh, 20. Yeah, there we go. And then I turn my own self down just a hair. Okay. Uh, v to hit with your, to punch it with your bash. Okay. Or sp head bonk by jumping on its head. Okay, we got to do the Mario. Pick up the gun. Don't mind if I do. Uh, Max is special. My special lowered crosshair is increased the vert verticality you can perceive... No, just give me classic. I don't want you to change stuff. Oh, okay. Go ahead, I'll catch you later. All right. <clears throat> okay, uh, hold to sprint. Yeah, hold the sprint. Yeah, okay. So he's got a double jump straight out the gates. Control is uh I don't I don't much care for that. I'd prefer it be C, but I'll just deal with what it is. Double jump, okay. Shift, space, space, okay. Ability bastion makes you invulnerable and consumes battery. You can turn it on and off to save battery. The, the battery generates over time. Okay, so it's Q.
Uh, then you pick up the green things to get your health back. Yeah, I saw that. Taking down an enemy drops healing cells, which quickly disappear. Yes, yes, yes. I got you. Gotta level up. Uh, taking down an enemy grants you experience. When your experience bar is full, you level up, increasing your power and health. Okay. I should have tested if I could shoot those. Perk selector? Okay. While Bastion is active, increases weapon damage by 30%, fire rate by 30%, and movement speed by 18%. Transforms Bash into Bonk Hammer. And it increases damage by 50%. Bash takedowns have 6% chance to drop 6 additional. I'm not going to get close. I'm not going to go for like melee stuff. So, It looks like I have infinite ammo as well. Okay. Could you check out what's inside this weird structure for me? Yes. Yeah, like I said, this was like twenty four ninety nine, uh, but I'm just super broke, dude. So I can't pick this kind of stuff up. Okay, my assumption is that green stuff bad. Uh, so, oh, Raptor SMG, bull shotgun. I'll take the SMG. Find Max. Well, Max isn't there. Okay. She threw this. Oh, there she is. Okay. Oh, I got hit. I don't like that turret guy. There we go. Get rid of that. Oh, and some other ones spawn. I don't want to get hit by these nades either. So obviously it's very arcadey. Doesn't look like I'm going to be able to do like crouch behind cover kind of a thing. Oh, but it is wave based, so you never know. There we go. Get some more health. Take out this old dude, and then we'll deal with this guy. I haven't seen any, like, I need to test and see if I could shoot these, the explosives, because that could be helpful. Control panel. Okay, the control panel displays information about the map, their class perks, okay, and it's tab, okay. Okay. It looks like ammo just regenerates kind of a thing. Can I bash this open? V? No. What was over here? Nothing? Okay. Hello. Well, station looks the perfect spot to settle. Could you just fix that generator up for me? I think it's safe now. Could you try again, please? Base camp. Okay. Workshop, museum, multiplayer. Start, difficulty, locker room. Okay. Yeah, let's go standard. Start game. Okay, let's see what else we got. Select difficulty. Select class. Yeah, okay. So there's new classes that you can unlock, probably when you have the whole thing. You start a run with a choice between four weapons. 
I don't have any of these, so. Smithing gel. Max sometimes deploys smithing gel, a friendly bot that can forge weapons and power cells. Okay. So there's a whole progression system. That's cool. I like that. No, there's nothing in here. So it doesn't look like you can grab onto ledges. There's like lots of room for like other upgrades and stuff that you could bring into your base camp. Cool. Was this something? Access Brobot Lounge? Oh, this is the multiplayer aspect. What are you doing, little dude? Look at this little dude. Okay, let's do this. Wrenches are a resource you can collect and keep after your run ends. Use them at Base Camp's Workshop to unlock permanent upgrades. Okay. I'm glad that wasn't the entire demo. I'm actually very appreciative of that. I hate it when they just give you just the tiniest taste of the game. So, all right, buddy, this is my first time exploring there with and with those. Oh, damn it. Okay. Open starter pack. Okay. A flare gun or power fists. Let's grab this flare gun. What's this? Oh, that's kind of cool. Is there an alt fire? No. So I'm going to have to be really mobile with this because it's uh, a slow fire rate. But it does have an explosive radius, which is good. And it is very effective as a jump fire, as most rocket launchers are. So it's just like a little mini rocket launcher. What was that? What did I pick up? Is it in T? No, okay. I don't know what that was. It was like a yellow thing. Okay. The drop on that's very gradual. Ow! Dang. I came down here. It must be like money or something that I'm picking up. The yellow stuff. I could probably slide on these or something. Yep, I can. I don't like turrets. Get out of here. I can see where maybe a melee build would be nice because you would always be close to the uh, healing stuff. But let's see what, what was over here. Because there was another way I could go. Yeah, I'm not going to slide around on that. It's gonna. Ooh, these guys are a little tankier. Ooh, I missed... Improved critical top on first 33% ammo increase, weapon damage by 30%. On first 33% ammo? I don't I don't understand. Let's get more crit. Cause I mean I have infinite ammo on this gun, so I don't know what that's all about. What's this dart spitter? Oh, that's kinda cool. I'm down for that. Uh, let's go check that purple door, actually. this I was thinking it didn't really look like it was... Or that looked like where I was supposed to go, and I was going to check something else out. But now that I think about it, last time I went into a purple door, it just gave me something. So It was like a little mini task that I had to do, and then... Cool! Comet Cannon! This is 38. That's way higher. What's this? Grandma shotgun. 
or pick up a power cell. Let's take this comet cannon. Uh oh. That probably wasn't the greatest idea. Well, whatever. We'll use it. I'm pretty low on health. Looks like maybe this has like a recharge or something. Like, cause see how it says 0% down in the bottom? Oh, cool, a heal. Nice. Max's chest, Sheriff's Carbine, okay. Frog Prince, when airborne increases weapons damage by 15%. Will do. Hey, what's up, dude? What you all about? There's Max. Was there anything else in here? What's that? I've analyzed those locked doors and it seems like we need some sort of keys to open them. Okay, Max. Oh, not available in the demo. Okay. Not available in the demo. So it's more powerful when I'm flying through the air. By 15%, I think it said. Top up our health here. Yeah, I can blow those up. That's good. get up high so that I can do some aerial stuff. Yeah, it does have a cooldown. Maybe those yellow things are uh, the wrenches that I was supposed to be picking up. Oops. Oh, okay. Yeah, we get an extra eight damage when I hit stuff while I'm flying through the air. Energy cell? Okay. Oh, drops a gun. What's this? Rhino LMG. Shall we switch to the Rhino LMG? 15, but it's much fire. Oh. Yeah, sure, I'll stick with an LMG. That other one did more damage, but... On second thought? Actually, no. I like this one more. It's a little bit more accurate, less... Less, uh... Less recoil. Oh, do they bounce? They do. Cool. There's a energy cell. Oops. I meant to use that before. Can I hurt myself? No. Okay, good. Good to know. I was trying to get close enough to look at it, but I ended up picking it up. 
Let's see. Take it down on an enemy with a critical damage triggers an explosion for 53. Heck yeah, I want that. Bugs. Travel to Oasis. I got a C? Oh, it's because I took too long. I was supposed to race through this a little bit faster. Water. I hope it's clean. I should analyze it. I'm going to use it back at the village. Okay. And you have hidden stuff behind the waterfall? Excellent. What do we got? Power fists? No, thank you. Grants two perk reroll tokens? Okay, sure. We'll get our heal on. We'll try to do this a little faster this time. Oh, I thought I killed that thing. Oh, no, it's somebody else came in. What's this? Dual Uzis. Let's do it. Rah! Frozen by something? Oh, these guys. They have a little blue tag next to their health. Wait, was there red stuff over there? No. Oh, you got to break the thing to break their shield. Okay. I just didn't notice earlier because I was using a explosive weapon. What's this? Igniter gun? Sure. Cool. Lights people on fire. heard something behind me. Jeez. What do we got? An elephant gun. That sounds awesome. Increases weapon damage by 25%, but decreases fire rate? No, we're taking this. Because that sounds amazing. Big boom. Big boom gun. Cool. Oops. Now, I'm going to take this too. It's a shotgun. I want either one of those. 
Ruins key. Oh, okay. That's what I needed back at the other place. The purple ships are hanging over this door seems to be spreading all over the lands. Okay. Oh man, I'm hurting. I don't think I realized how hurting I was, and I just jumped into a grenade. I can't go back, can I? Oh man, I did probably. Oh, I didn't click the thing to give me health back. Oh, I died. This is fun. I'm having fun. Wait, did I just restart the whole thing? Damn it. Okay, shut up. Yeah, I know. All right. We're going to take uh, this. We're going to channel that old school Azer in Warframe days. But this time we're going to do it faster. I don't know what that is, but I don't care. Oh, there's somebody else over here. Get out of here, buddy. So full damage doesn't happen unless I'm zoomed in. That's fine, because this is still a lot of damage, and this is the way I play games. All right, we go back in here. We jump across this. Okay, dual rascals. Sounds good. New perk. Uh, reduce the bastion cooldown while bastion is active. Repairs 5% of your scratch damage every 1%. Uh, sounds good. I don't know what scratch damage is and why that would be something other than anything else, but whatever. Wait, I'm going back the wrong way. Dang it. This way. So yeah, it does. Okay, so scratch damage is non-complete you can see the bar oh well oh, sorry 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 dude i didn't mean to do that uh bull shotgun don't want to increase pickup gathering range by yes okay uh you didn't have anything for me and now we're going this is not what we want wait right oh yeah this way That old Latron Prime skills. Oh yeah, I can't grab onto things. this we'll take cannon oh that looks fun ow oh there's acid okay Oh, 
Oh, that was an explosion. I thought it would despawn, but I'm playing this one a lot more fast and loose. Wait, did I miss something? No, no red dots behind me. This is okay uh, for smaller stuff, but I need to remember to switch over to this to take out the bigger guys. Uh, while you have no scratch damage, increases fire rate, no. Uh, sure. Oh! Hey! Alright. I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to put all of the, like, demos that I play into uh, into their own things. Like, their own, into their own uh, playlist. What's this? Thumper? Uh, explosion range? Explosion? I didn't like this lightning gun as much as I thought I would. What's this, though? Increases all damage by 20% against stunned and staggered enemies. Uh, no thanks. We're going to go ahead and use this. Ow. Dang. Quit using a grenade launcher against this stuff, Azer. What are you doing? What gun is this? Oh, it's the Comet Cannon. We've had one of those already. I know you're back here, dude. That's it. I've had enough of you. Had enough of you. Had enough of you. And enough of you. Maybe not quite enough of you. Let's take out these turrets. Oh no, it didn't do more damage when I was zoomed in. I was reading into it wrong. Oh, there it is. Not quite as good as I used to be. Did I miss something over here? Yeah, you see how the scratch damage is your... Uh, it's like damage that isn't fully... Ow! Dang it. I need this health, though. It's not fully actualized damage. About to bonk your head, boy. Oh, there's a thing over here. Yeah, see, it only heals the, the like, somewhat. Do I want to keep this? Yeah, I'm going to keep this. The igniter gun was cool. I liked that. So what led over here? See, I don't even know where I'm going now. What I'd like to see, uh, this is, uh, I'm not, I don't really have any beef with this game. I'm actually having a whale of a time. Uh, but what I'd like to see is a, uh, a more noticeable difference between the, uh, the HUD display for like explosives on the ground and just enemies that are outside of your range of view. Like, see how I got all these HUD displays? that are showing me directions for stuff that's bad. I'd like to be able to easily tell at a glance what's an explosive and what's not. What's this? Oh, dude, you, you know I'm going to go kunai. Oh, yeah. Oh, I got distracted by the kunai. But that, that means I don't have explosions, but... Cool. Rah. Oh, 
Oh, whoa, and they, like, bounce in between other targets and stuff? Okay. Want to get rid of that thing as soon as possible. I'm going to need health here pretty soon, though. All right, fine. The kunai is not, not quite as good as I was hoping it was going to be, but that's all right. I probably need upgrades for it or something. Need to run in here, grab this health. Shoot this dude in the face. Shoot that dude. What is that? Oh, jeez. Let's get back behind cover. Take it, thin out their numbers. And then we'll deal with whatever this is. Oh! Oh! I'm hacked. I'm hacked again. No, no, no. I'm, I'm okay. I'm okay. It's that purple thing that's doing it. There, it's happening again. Oh, no. Thank you for the health. I needed that. Oh, and I was like shoving it around. That was crazy. That was super cool, though. I don't know what all's hacking me. It's just like this purple thing that shows up. What's that? Oh, I want that gun. I want that gun. I want that gun. Oh, it's an LMG. Okay. Don't hack me. Oh, dang. I died again, dude. <laughs> Okay, uh, base camp now, instead of restart. So I got wrenches. And so now I can go and, like, do stuff here? Is that where it was? Yeah, I can. Okay. You start with the, the run with a choice between four weapons. Max sometimes deploys Bizarre Bob, a friendly bot that can craft items using power cells. Max sometimes deploys Smith and Joe, they can forward weapons and using power cells. We can upgrade your weapons using power cells. Okay. Let's use that so that we can have a better choice of weapons. Man, I want this game. I do. Max sometimes deploys Bizarre Bob, a friendly contrast. Okay. I'll get the upgrade guy. Because that sounds good. Does he show up in here? No, because I don't have any weapons yet. It would be after I start the mission. And now this should give me four choices. Yeah, wow. A hornet bow, a tommy gun, which sounds amazing, a dragoon mortar, or the quasar. Of course, we're taking the tommy gun. Rattle them. Rattle them, boys. Rattle them. Ow. I already like this tommy gun. This is awesome. I want to see what its range capabilities are, though. See, I, I thought this was a bad guy when I saw the HUD display. That's what, that's what I was talking about earlier. Like, if it was some... I mean, I don't... I, I'm not a game designer. You know, I just play games, so... If they could make it really apparent that that was an explosive that I was seeing, that would help me out a lot. Just in the overall flow of the game. I'm not talking about something to make the game easier for me. I'm talking about, like, this game is obviously meant to be played at a high rate of speed. You know, that kind of stuff. Maybe something a little bit... I mean, that's good. They've, they've done... They've notified you that there's an explosive right next to you, which is good. I just wonder if maybe they could, like, put a little explosive, uh, you know... Oh, what's this? Okay. 
Okay. I did like that flare gun. I don't want the power fists. But I... Oh, that's a blue flare gun, though. Yeah, let's get the blue flare gun. We'll get the energy cells next time we get something like that. Uh, I don't know. Maybe if it had, like, a little explosion, you know, signal on it. Like, uh... Like, hey, there's explosive damage over here kind of a thing. As opposed to just being a red mark. Because when I'm looking at him... It kind of means to me that... See how there's like a white tag over there? I guess I would probably get used to it. Now that I think about it. The Shredder, which looks amazing. Uh, but I'm not going to take it because that's... Wait, Brawl deals melee damage and plus two healing cells on takedown. Mm, no. I'm going to look for passive regen is what I'm going to do. That kind of stuff. Uh, igniter gun, no thanks. Increases fire rate by 35% for six seconds when burned, frozen, instead hacked, or blinded. Okay, I'll take that. New perk. Stim bubble. Makes me faster. Okay. Sure. Good deal. Did the little guy not show up, though? That I bought with my stuff? Didn't I get a Ruins key? Oh, yeah. Not available in the demo. Okay. I really want upgrades for this Tommy gun, because I like this. Insane. It ramps up my speed when I sh put on my shield, so it just increases the fire rate of a Tommy gun, which is hilarious. <laughs> I love the. Boy, you're killing me with your stuff here. Get out of there. Ow. Yeah, I don't know. You know what? You don't need to listen to me, honestly. I. Ow! Oh, dang! What is happening? Oh, it was because I was on the edge of that slider. It was trying to slide me forward. Dang, I took a lot of damage in here. I think I was relying too much on the... the heal that I was getting from my shield. For my upgrades, so I, I got kind of sloppy. Ah, I did it again! Dang. Get out of here. What's my other weapon? Oh yeah, the igniter. I'll use that. Dual stingers? Oh, that's kind of cool. It's a decent amount of damage, too. All right. I need health, though. I need health, and I need to fix my scratch damage. Oops. Oh, okay. It was just a reload. Dang, my bullet hell skills are just not up to par anymore. D I got hit again. Dang. I need help. I need help. Yeah, this is a good time. I wonder what it's like in multiplayer. It's probably pretty sweet, I would imagine. You better watch out. I need my health back, please. Thank you. Because I'm apparently bad at this game. Sheriff's Carbine. This is 38. This is 42. Half your bonus movement speed is added as damage. We're taking this. Interesting.
I remember from the last time I was here, I want to take this thing out. Because it's just going to keep pumping these nerds out. Grants infinite ammo while Bastion is active. Increases heavy weapons damage by 15% and reduces their speed penalty by 5%. Uh, I mean, I, I guess. I, I don't care. I'm just going to take this. What do we got here? Splasher rifle? Let's try it. Don't hack me. That's kind of cool. It's got a little bit of a spread to it. I'm hacked. That's okay because I'm behind this wall. Oh, it, it reverses your controls. Now I understand. So when I get hacked, it just reverses my controls. No, no, no. all this health I need all this health and I should have put up my shield before I did that but I'm an idiot so my problem is definitely sustain that's what I need to be working on what's this junk rifle no, I'm going to keep the sheriff's car being... Oh! Was there like a special ability that it had? Yeah, big mag, 25%. Level 3 is 20% more damage. Okay. Yeah, buddy. I need to keep an eye on the time frame. I'm having a whale of a time playing this game. sheriff in town boys and it's at, oh and it's as aroused as he gets hit I really need to hit like a sustain trait of some kind what's this bandito gun let's try it I can use that. Put it. Purple stuff. Get out of here. Oh! D? Whoa! Alright. That almost killed me. I don't know why I activated that back there. I'm getting shot from behind. Again. WWW. Okay. I am so gonna die. Need that health, I need that health. Need to not get hit by one of these guys. Okay. There's some more health, alright. Yeah, I really need some help on the sustain. 
I am totally going to die in this. This is going to kill me. Yep, I'm dead. <laughs> I'm going to play it one more. All right, we're going to go at this one more time. I got six of these, which I think means I can unlock one more of these. Yeah, I can. Uh, Bizarre Bob deploys Bizarre Bob, a friendly bot that can craft items using power cells. Boom. Okay. This is nutty. Okay, let's do this. Okay, so how are we going to start this one out? I'm going to start this one out with AoE. That's what I'm going to do. Because I need to try to sustain more. Which means that I need to be thinking more about maneuvering than my aim. Obviously, it's going to be a little harder to deal with these little dudes. Isn't there a dude right here? Yeah, there he is. Okay. I still got hit in that engagement. A little bit less focus on my accuracy and more focus on my uh avoidance what do we got windmill dark spit high fire rate 80 percent fire rate over one second while shooting pierce oh pierces No, I'm going to take the power cell. We're just going to stick with explosions and stuff to maintain the focus on what I already know I'm trying to do here. We'll get a gun for picking it up. And then hopefully we'll get one of those things where she'll bring out the thing and give me upgrades. Okay, bite the, bite the bullet. Taking damage increases all damage by 30% and armor by 16%. Yes. Take less damage, good. Okay. Is that a flamethrower? You're damn right, I'm taking that. I don't need this guy. Okay. You kick some robot bubble, I'm gonna chew bubble gum. Right on. Whoa. It's telling me there's something above me. All right, whatever. I took an absolute metric ton of damage right there. What are you pointing at? Game? I'm gonna irritate, oh, there he is. It's happening. My brain is focusing. It's 
why I'm talking less. Entering zone. Tomahawk? That's cool. Hold on. I just want to test that real quick. Do I throw it? I do. That's cool. I'm not going to use it, but... Cool. All right, this is the last one, guys. I'm going to have to wrap this up after this because I am having a bunch of fun, but I'm also starting to, like, zone out into playing the game. What do we got here? Uh, better Comet Cannon than mine? Yes. Yeah, it is better. Projectiles are explosive and thick. Plus 10 damage, but minus 15 explosion radius. Okay. Let's get our health back. Let's do this thing. Increases uh, healing cells and repair robot efficiency by 15%. Okay. Deals 38 damage to and apply high impact to enemies dealing damage to you. Nope, we're going for the, uh, the health. Oh yeah, what was this? Real quick look. Dual sawed-offs. That's cool. Let's use these. I like that. That. Uh, I like that fire, flame terror, but still. We we still do want to try out stuff, even though I'm like starting to do, be all try hard on the game. just takes me a little while to activate my brain on stuff. this dual Uzis. I used those before. I don't really want to use them. Okay. You're all going to group up for me like that. I'll be happy to put you down. I knew that thing was back here somewhere. There was way too many little flying dudes.
Oh, that was bad. There we go. A new flamethrower? No. I'm taking the power cell. We're going to hope the next time we run into la that one lady that we'll have the, the ability to... Uh, wait, was it over here? Yeah, it is over here. Upgrade one of these weapons. Nazar comes fully online. <laughs> it only took an hour of playing the game. Of course, I'm not fully online. I'd be headshotting all of these things if that was the case, but I'm close. And the, the choice to get more health orbs helps. Gives me more sustain. I could tell that was my problem. I saw that other guy. Where'd he go? this a torpedo rifle that's pretty cool this one does more damage though all right i really want to use that but I'm not going to take a bow. Oh, I'm back. So I need to go over here and go up and then take a left, it looks like. go this way yeah or that way let's go to the yellow area let's see what that's all about okay i'm hacked now that i understand that it turns around my controls i can get out of the way Wait till the hack's over. Then we're going to pop this. Thanks for your health, bud. Huh. I wonder how I get up there. Can I, can I jump on this guy? Okay. Maybe I need like a rocket jump or something like that to get in there.
I just ran out of A time and hit into B. Dang it. Right as I got here. Oh, what's this? Oh, this dude's got something cool for me. Rhino LMG deals shock damage. This is one of the dudes that I bought. Sure. Why not? Let's get one. And better shot off. Okay, that's pretty cool. Increases fire rate when burn stun, but I have to skip it about that, but, but, uh, no thanks. I'm going to leave the sawed offs, even though I really like them. What's this? Negative 1038. This uh, explosive gun is starting to fall off on its damage potential. So if I can find something else that will fire similarly, that would be a good plan. Increases elemental damage by 10%. Deploying Bastion rolls a random element. While Bastion is active, deals 26 damage of that element to all enemies within 6 meters. Every fourth shot increases the next weapon shot by... There we go. We're taking that. What's this? Splasher rifle? No, thank you. There's a boss somewhere, it looks like. Or is it just this whole group of enemies that's the boss? Where'd you come from? Told you I got in the zone. It's happening. Upgrade the combat cannon. Let's do it again. Oh, I don't. I don't have it. I can't do it. I can't upgrade it again. We'll take the health back. Reinforced door, pretty well guarded. Roger. Uh oh. It's a boss. Time for all of the DPS because it's a boss. Yeah, we're done. <laughs> we're free to boss. Okay, that is a decent time to go ahead and call it. Is this the entire demo? 
would be a nice touch to have a boss fight and then the end of the demo. I mean, I would love to play more, but... Eh, password one, two, three, four. Nice. That was a lot of fun. Uh, I had tons of fun doing that. Let's go back to base camp real quick and we'll use up our last wrench. I might have to talk to Derb about this and see if maybe he wants to join in. I, I got to figure out. I'm going to have to figure out 25 bucks to pick it up. Like I said, I'm super broke. I'm not saying that to for pity. It's just the truth. It is what it is. I have to be very selective about the games that I play. But I'm willing to bet he'll be interested once he plays the demo. So I'll send this video to him, too. Peace out, everybody. I'm Azarellis. This was tons of fun. Go check out RoboQuest. If you don't got the cash, play the demo. This was super fun just playing a demo. Uh, yeah, good stuff. Thanks for watching. Like, comment, subscribe, all that kind of stuff. And uh, share me with your friends if you know anybody who wants to watch an old boomer play video games. And uh, it's, yeah, I had a great time. So. If you want to help out the channel, you can have my donation links in the description below. And uh, otherwise, of course, the best thing to do is just to like, comment, uh, and or subscribe. Peace. I'll see you guys on the next one.